but let's go with random. Fingers crossed. Let's high roll. What's up, guys? Barry Gaming here, back with some more free-to-play Mythic Heroes. And today we're, uh, you know, we're going over. We're gonna finish out this Amaterasu event. We've done pretty much all the quests religiously. The last day, of course, we're gonna do a bunch of summons here as well to get the last couple few keys. We've been doing good, and of course, we have the Fable Agora going up, refreshing for those diamonds, which is going to be amazing progress and give it us a ton. We're up to eight thousand again now. We are at a point where we're about to get some explosive progress as soon as we get a little bit more Stardust. So probably in the next video, we'll be able to cap her out at uh, 260. I imagine that's going to give us a ton of progress. Now, before we do that, we still need to be hunting some more copies of our heroes because... We still have two copies of her on the on the uh, limited banner. Somehow we still we actually managed to get one Amaterasu, which was crazy. We have some summons to do today. I think we're just gonna knock every single one of them out. Should we start over here? You know what? We'll, we'll do the ten summons. We'll do ten regular summons right here. Then we'll jump over and do two summons on the limited banner. Ooh, we got an SSR. Joan of Arc. Ah, not really building her. It's always it's. Uh, well, that was rude. Anyway, <laughs> uh, it's always rough on free-to-play accounts getting hero copies of heroes that you're really not going to invest in. It feels like it's not progress, whereas doing it on other accounts, it's like, oh, yeah, I want to bring every hero up to max eventually. So, yeah, we do have two summons right here. Everybody, fingers crossed. I think we have an SSR hero right here. I think. I think I was right. Oh, no. Lubu. I know some people love Lubu. I just don't want him right now. <laughs> All right, we'll get one more summon, and chances are we don't high roll another SSR hero, but... <laughs> yes! All right, we got another Artemis copy off of this banner. Yes, so that means we have one left to go. Hopefully we can snag it. When When's this banner reset? Three days, so it is at the end of this week. All right, so now we come on over here. We get the event quest. We get the remaining four keys. Now we are all set to get this event complete. Can we high roll more scrolls? Maybe some fake crystals? Maybe another copy? Because you guys remember, like in our first 10 summons, we got a copy on this event. Let's see how this turns out. Did we get anything? Not really. No. One more. Anything good here? Oh, no. We didn't get anything good here either. All right, we got one four key one four keys one i was gonna say one ten bomb but it's only four keys left to go i mean we got some more diamonds so <sighs> we do get the copy yes yes i know i see you so we got another copy we got to go ahead and get her fused up we did get some more food for the luminarch faction and we have progression now to celestial too not too bad if we can get her up to infinite that would be amazing uh joan of arc can go up to legendary one which is going to net us some diamonds and power amaterasu going up to level three there okay is there anybody else Ooh, lubu lubu's going up to level three as well okay cool so let's go grab those extra diamonds see if they make any bit of difference chances are Probably not. It's like 20 more diamonds. I wish they gave you more for upgrading these heroes. The other thing we can do is come into the event. Because we got her leveled up, we get additional fate, which is really, really nice. Do we want to increase her divinity 7 for 1,000 diamonds? That actually sounds like a good deal. And you know what? Hmm. Have we done that with the other ones? We did it with Faust. Let's get Amaterasu and Western Queen up to Divinity 7. That sounds like a very, very good deal. Because uh, we have tons of these low-tier resources, so we can just go ahead and take care of that. And I mean, they can net us a lot, of good, a lot of good resources. I don't think the level of them matters to get them to Divinity 7, right? I don't think. It just costs the actual 
uh, the actual divinity gems to get us there. And that only takes a couple of level three, I believe. I think you only have to do it for getting her to seven. Because, yeah, even on six, you're not using divinity gems level three. It's just right here that you need them. So that's going to net us 1,000 diamonds, which also means we can come over to Western Queen, do the same exact thing. Just got to hit that right there. I think that's what we need to do, right? And that right there nets us 1,000 diamonds there and 1,000 diamonds here. That's really, really good. Like, that's insanely good. Don't forget to do that. Maybe that's the lesson for the day is make sure you are doing these. Holy cow. That's a very small investment for a very big payoff. I mean, that means we get a whole other summon. So can we hit three SSR heroes in a row? Maybe. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe. Okay. All right. I figured that would be a little greedy. We are oh, we're nine summons away from a hero card. You know what? Hold on. I just want to get another. I want another summon. I know I can get one here, right? Oh, they're all sold out for two days. <laughs> no. I wanted one scroll to make this super, super easy. There's no way to get one scroll, is there? Do I got some like maybe weekly quest to do? Hmm. We'd have to finish like everything, right? Because we only have two of these chests left unclaimed. Although there's this one. No. We would have to get everything done, and I don't think we can do it. We could get three pieces here. We can't accept any more Fable Agora quest till tomorrow, so. All right, we're doing it the slow way, boys and girls. We're going one scroll at a time. Let's see if we high roll and finish this out with a sweet hero card. Oh, my God. Another Joan of Arc. Oh, that does mean she's going to Legendary 1, though, doesn't it? <laughs> Why, Joan? Why couldn't you be Artemis or Susano or something like that? That would have been sweet. I've personally never used Joan of Arc, though. If you guys have, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about the hero. I've just never had an experience to actually use her. She could be really good. It's just I always find better options to go for. Okay, we got a few more summons to finish this out. We want that hero card today to hopefully get us maybe even like another Artemis copy. That would be really sweet. I'd take Anubis, Susano, Poseidon, any of those though. Are we going to hit anything? Probably not, right? Probably not. Last one, I think. No. But it's all about the hero card, so let's see what happens. Hmm. So GNM is a really good hero copy. The problem being, we're not really building them. Hmm. I feel like I pass on it. I don't really want the, I mean, GNM is really good hero copy, but again, we're just nowhere near being able to build the hero. And you don't really want to focus on more than one hero at a time. And we're already doing like both Artemis and Susano. So let's go with random. Fingers crossed. Let's high roll. <laughs> All right. Here we go. <laughs> that is sweet. We got ourselves another Susano copy. Which means he's probably getting really close to leveling up further. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. So tomorrow we'll have some good progress in campaign because we should be able to get her leveled up by then. We're so close. We're like 100,000 away. Should be about one day. So hopefully you guys enjoy this one. Let me know what you guys think. The event was overall pretty successful. We did hit two of the copies out of three. Maybe we hit the last one by the end of the event. See you guys next time.